Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I thought I would do something that I've seen on YouTube before and I thought I might as well try it too. So today I'm going to show you my top 10, let's see if I have 10, most worn items in my closet. So let's get on with the video. Okay, so starting off with accessories, we are finishing summer. So these are just things that I've been wearing in summer. Um, and then things I just love that I actually just wear all year round that are a good transition for the fall if you would like to pick up some of these outfits. So start off with accessories. Um, something that I always gravitate towards are these sunglasses. They're like little John Lennon sunglasses. I got them, I got them at Forever 21 for I think 10 bucks which is so cheap and so good and I just love them so they're not too expensive they look just like the Ray-Ban ones but for way less so yeah these are from Forever 21 Forever 21 has a bunch of like cheap accessories like this too so if you want something like this you just head on over to Forever 21 and I bet you can find one the next thing that I have been wearing a lot and then I can also transition this into the fall, I think is this little straw hat. So as you can see, it even works with this outfit. It's just so nice. It protects my hairline. It's cute. It makes every outfit a little bit cuter. So it has this black ribbon around it. And I got this from Target. Something I noticed about Target is that they actually recycle their um, accessories a lot. So um, I bought this two summers ago and I just saw it last month, um, this exact same hat. So Target, it's about 20 bucks I'd say, and I've had it for two years and it's really done great, I'd say. The next thing that I've been wearing nonstop are these super cheap little Target sandals. They're by the brand Universal Thread. Um, I do wear an eight and a half and they didn't have an eight and a half so I sized down to an eight and it works just just as fine. Um, these are just great, like cute with any outfit. They make it casual, just nice and fast. You slip it on off. I do not like um, flip flops. I think this is a little bit nicer and it's black so you can really wear it with anything. And brown too, so you can really pair it with anything. Dress, shorts, it just it's so cute. Okay, now I'm gonna go with bottoms. So I showed these in a haul a couple months ago, and I have been living in them all summer because they are incredible. These are the brand Melville mom shorts. So as you can see, they are not, they're not super short. They're actually a nice length. And then I love the colors, my favorite color in jeans. Um, they come in small, medium, or I don't know if they come in medium or large. I just saw, I'm gonna say they have small and medium. I got mine in the size small. I wear 25 at most stores. So if you are also the size small, uh, 25, a small short for you. But yeah, the length is great. They're not like super short and I just, I love them. Um, going on with that theme, the next thing I have are some Abercrombie and Fitch shorts. These are a nice dark pair. Um, these are also not too short and I like this color a lot. Um, it has a little bit of distress and on the side it has this cute little flap thing. So. I really like these. I got these on sale for 20 bucks and I feel like the shorts are super discounted right now at Abercrombie. If you just go online, like they have the best discounts online and I really like these shorts. And when you wash them and put them in a the dryer and I'm notorious for shrinking things, this actually did not shrink, it went back to size. So really, really helpful. Okay, so back on jeans, the next thing that I'm going to show you is something that I've had actually for two years now, and these are my 501 Levi's. So they have the button fly, um, they have this patch right here, and then distressing at the bottom. 
these hit me a little above my ankle and yeah so they're 501 jeans so they're not they're not i wouldn't say the most comfortable jeans but they have elastic to me they look so cute with a regular t-shirt um sometimes i like dressing it up with like a more silk soft blouse and i wear these all fall along like these are so cute i wear them with sandals tennis shoes anything um, Levi's 501s are an investment. They are something that will cost you unless you get lucky and you find them at Marshalls like I did. I found these at Marshalls and I got these for 20. But if you go online to Urban Outfitters, um, Levi's.com, even Nordstrom, these jeans will cost you about $98. So if you don't want to spend that much, which I feel like, why would you? Go to Marshalls when you're feeling lucky, check out the jeans section, go in the juniors, go in the women's section, and you'll probably find some. You can also find um, Levi's shorts there too. So Levi's is a good brand. Like I said, these have lasted me two years and they don't they don't look a day over too. Um, now I'm going to talk about blouses. So, Something that I wear all the time is this plain white t-shirt. Um, this is from Madewell, it's in a size small. Um, anything from Madewell is, how much are these? I'm gonna say $18 maybe, but anything from Madewell is made well. So um, you can wash these a ton of times and they will still keep their shape. Um, Gosh, I love it so much. Like, it's just a white t-shirt, but I like the cut of it. I like how it goes up like this. I don't like v-necks and yeah. So white t-shirts, great. I recommend Madewell if you want something that's going to last, like this one. So the next thing in my shirt section is something that I got for so cheap, but it has become my favorite t-shirt. And it is this t-shirt, this Pontiac Racing t-shirt from Target. This is a crop top and I actually sized up in this to a medium because these shirts do shrink and they shrink a ton. So if you ever get this brand, um, Mighty Fine t-shirts from Target because they, they have that brand a lot. Like there's a bunch of t-shirts that they sell, graphic t-shirt, graphic crop top t-shirts. Um, size up because these things shrink so much like it is a completely different size when you buy it from once you uh, wash it I mean I guess you don't have to dry it but I do because I like to get the wrinkles out so I just size it up um I got this for seven dollars the t-shirts at Target do go on sale so whenever you see them full price they're like twelve dollars but then they go on sale and then they're like seven which is so cheap like anything under ten dollars like i have to have like that is just so good the next thing that i got is also or the next thing that i've been wearing and i'm going to keep wearing in the fall is this this button um crop top block, uh, tea tank from abercrombie bitch i got size small which is my regular size this does not shrink this looks cute with everything, high-waisted shorts, high-waisted jeans, um, underneath a sweater, like I love this. It seems so simple, but when you accessorize it with gold jewelry, it just really, really elevates your look. I think it's just nice. Um, it's kind of an off black, as you can see. I wouldn't say it's like full on black, but I know it looks like nothing impressive, but it is really nice. And I even have it in white because I love it so much and I just use it all the time. And then um, the straps are like a good like size and you can't see your bra and you don't have to wear a strapless bra or worry about all that junk. So yeah, so I got that on sale for $9 in Abercrombie.com. Um, they come in white, like a brown, a yellow, black, gray. Yeah, so. I really swoop that up now because I don't know how much longer they're going to have them because they really are good quality. They're originally $18, but like I said, I got mine for 9 and they keep going on sale. So you should get it if you're in need of just a basic tank top that 
it's not just your average tank top, like it has little buttons, so it gives it a little pizzazz, and yeah. The next thing I'm gonna show you is this chambray shirt, chambray button-up t-shirt uh, blouse, and it has a, a drawstring at the bottom. Um, I love chambray, I love a Canadian tuxedo, Canadian suit, I love that look. Um, this also looks great with white shorts, um, black shorts, I wear that a lot. Um, I also think this looks nice with jeans, like any color really, except I like to not have the same color of bottom jeans if I am going to do a Canadian tuxedo thing. But yeah, this one is also from Abercrombie and I got it on sale. Abercrombie is really nice in that when you wash things, the quality stick, um, doesn't like get all weird or something because sometimes like when you buy stuff from like Forever 21 or something the quality or it gets weird after you wash it and it's never how you bought it which is so sad so yeah definitely check out Abercrombie I feel like they have a bunch of staples that you can wear and wash and they won't die on you which is a good thing the last thing I'm going to show you guys is something that I got at Zara so this is my favorite outfit and I wear it all the time. Um, it's a romper, but it just fits like a baby doll dress and it kind of stitches here, the little button and then this little string. This is actually so cute. I wear this with um, boots and tights in the winter and then in the summer I'll wear it with like flip, um, sandals and it's just like such a cute outfit i love it so much and it feels really freeing because you're not constricted and since it fits like loose like a baby doll dress it i don't know it's just super cute and super flattering and it's like short but not too short where you feel exposed it's it's a romper and i i love it so much zara is something that i'm actually getting really interested in because they have such cute clothes and i feel like that's something that i've never really like gone into until a couple months ago when I went into Zara and like wanted to die because like everything was just so 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 cute but yeah that's all I have for today thank you so much for watching um if you like this video go ahead and give it a thumbs up and if you aren't already please subscribe to my channel it'd be super cool so I'll talk to you guys later bye